West Oahu wet and wild cam. You see the bounce there. It's going to be windy today, later today, and into tomorrow. Mm, tomorrow, the difference is we've got a big dry air mass, and the winds will even be higher. A live shot with the Zephyr cam. You see partly cloudy skies. Uh, Irwin is gone now. It's post-tropical, but uh, the batch of moisture associated with it is going to just fade away and move to the north. I was hoping for some uh, more moisture coming up from the south. It, I mean, it's still a chance, but that's not likely or, uh, at this point. Uh, so I don't, I don't see a significant rain for the next two weeks. So we're going to continue to be dry. Uh, that's why we have the fire weather watch. Not that the, the ground is dry. That's obvious, especially in uh, west uh, leeward areas. Uh, but the dry air mass over top in, in the air, that's the problem with the winds. Fires can start and spread rapidly. And, uh, it's all leeward areas, but of course, Maui has fires burning. So that's an issue. Uh, 15 to 30, gusts 40 to 45. These winds won't be as high as what we saw on August 8th, not nearly. That was kind of a rare event, but still, it uh, poses a problem here. I mean, the wind's already up to 15 to 20 now. I'd say 20 to 30 today, maybe gusting to 40, and then for tomorrow, maybe look at, at about five miles. So about 20 to 35, maybe gusts upwards of 45 possible. That's Those are pretty strong winds, and uh, that can spread fire pretty rapidly. But you can see not much rain here, just these overnight morning showers, especially on Maui, on leeward rain. It's hard to come by. Uh, your ocean forecast, watch out for that UV index, 12.4. <laughs> That's pretty high today. 2 to 4 in the south shore for your surf, east shore 2 to 4. Uh, partly sunny to mostly, uh, it's partly cloudy to mostly sunny. I'd say 89 degrees for your high today. That's what it was the last few days. Almost everyone's in the upper 80s, Hilo maybe some mid 80s. And of course, we've got the big football game here coming up Friday uh, at 5. It looks like it'll be in the mid 80s at around kickoff time. So that's looking good. Uh, that's the good news. We have beautiful weather because we have some outdoor things going on this weekend with the game on uh, Friday and then we have the Labor Day weekend of course and things looking good all the way through the winds might even go down Tuesday into Wednesday just got to get through the next 24 hours and make sure everybody stays safe